if you want to make $140,000 a year as an IA, you're going to have to put in the kind of hours that the staff adjust, the CAT staff adjuster puts in, right? You're going to have to not say no to deployments. You're going to have to be out there 612s, 712s, right? And not be taking days off, especially in early parts of the storm. So it's, it's kind of, it's pretty similar, the truth be told. This is Adjuster TV, Adjusters First. This video is sponsored by Hague Education. Use code Adjuster TV to get a 15% discount on damage assessment, CE training, industry certifications, books, and tools at HagueEducation.com. And it's a simple thing. It's not like you have to like memorize their, everybody's life story that works at the company. You just have to show a little bit of initiative in having some interest in who that company is, right? And companies are just big groups of people, right? Um, and they want to bring in people that are interested in the company, right? And it, because they're all kind of, they're all there. I mean, you know, you may come into a company like just looking for a job and oh, I just want a paycheck or whatever, but you're going to make friends and you're going to kind of get sort of inculcated into the company culture a little bit and it's going to be your team, right? So show up to these interviews and things like that with a little bit of skin in the game, right? Like Andy said, and doing stuff, I mean, the minimum amount of research on what that company's up to. Um, you know, they just bought uh, another company. They bought a technology company, right? So you're, you, you can you can say, hey, listen, hey, you know, I don't really have any other questions, but I just want to let you know, I'm really excited that, you know, I noticed you guys just bought such and such uh, insure tech company that uh, has a all digital platform to make claims easier. I'm really excited to get my hands on that. I'm stoked about getting, you know, into that program. Oh, oh wow, yeah, we did. We did. We're really proud of that. Okay, great. You know, A plus on this one, right? Well, this guy's going in the callback or probably shoe in pile, right? That's all you got to do. I mean, it's not, it's not rocket science. So right now is uh, a t kind of a bad time to be an IA. Like, mm. And when I say right now, I mean like this month um, because of, and it's just, it's, it's like this every single year, whether you're a brand new person or you're an experienced person, everything just drops off after October, right? Um, hurricane season's not quite over, but all indications are that it's going to be pretty quiet, a pretty quiet one, right? We really didn't have anything happen this year at all and barely had anything happen last year, right? Uh, so if you're like, I want to have a career in claims, um, going the staff side, as, you know, and if, and if you'd like to travel and you'd like to do all that stuff, going on the, the staff cat side, not a bad way to go. There's certainly cons to it. Like, like, you know, Andy was just saying, as far as you can't really turn down a deployment when you're on the cat staff team, right? Like you can as an IA, like you worked seven months as an IA and they call you and they say, Hey, we got a little tiny ice storm up in long Island. Do you want to go? Listen, I am totally burned out. Can I just catch you guys on the next one? Yeah, no problem. Just call us back when you're ready to go. Right. On, that's the IA side on the staff side. They're going to be like, uh, we've already booked your room. Your flight leaves, uh, tonight at 5 PM and, uh, we'll see you there. So you really don't have a choice, right? Yeah. So there's pros and cons to both. Um, certainly, but I think more than anything, if you want to make $140,000 a year as an IA, you're going to have to put in the kind of hours that the staff adjust, the CAT staff adjuster puts in, right? You're going to have to not say no to deployments. You're going to have to be out there 612s, 712s, right? And not be taking days off, especially in early parts of the storm. So it's, it's kind of, it's pretty similar, the truth be told. If you want to watch the rest of this episode where I answer other questions ad-free, as well as get access to a members-only segment question and answer. Head on over to adjustertvplus.com and become a member right now.